All right, welcome back. We are in Sunken Land again. This is uh, the new patch, 0 0.5.10. And I want to talk a little bit about the Gun Workshop. So it has changed some. You no longer tear your weapons down here. You put your weapons in the recycler, and then that gives you your parts. So parts are still basically the same. You've got barrels, you've got muzzles, you've got receivers and stocks and all that kind of stuff. That hasn't really changed. It still needs power. That hasn't changed. How it's changed is you don't go to the blueprint kiosk and sit there for hours and hours and hours trying to get that last one thing, the 4 by scope that you need. You actually buy it as a blueprint. I'll show you that here after a bit. There are a few things about this I think some people are a little confused on because I was confused on it at the beginning. Surely I'm not the only one. You only actually need this top section to build it. The bottom section is accessories. The accessories don't really give you a heck of a lot, but they can still help. So if you want to create the bolt action, you just need three pieces. You need a barrel of choice, you need a, a stock or, or sorry, receiver, and then you need some kind of a scope. It could be just your basic iron, iron sights. When you get into these things, these do a variety of other small bits, and some of them don't seem to actually do anything. Like, there's no increase. It doesn't change. It says increases accuracy. Does it? I don't know. Uh, rate of fire is helpful, sure. This one I don't understand. This low spring actually reduces your rate of fire. I don't know why you'd want to fire slower. Maybe a really, really high rate of fire gun, possibly. Uh, lightweight material slightly reduce the aiming and by slightly it's very slightly and then muzzle speed that's that's a very nice thing to have uh, your brakes you can reduce the recoil that's kind of nice it's not that terribly helpful but it does help uh, the infrared sight I kind of find it useless to be honest but it does help when you're shooting from the hip and then your stocks or uh, grip excuse me that give you increased accuracy or reduce recoil that doesn't say anything in here so I don't know how much it actually works if you see this blue icon that means you have learned the blueprint either you found the blueprint or you bought the blueprint so you can put it with just these three so like this one right here I can produce it if I have these so if I have these on me I can produce this guy right here I do not know the blueprints for these yet. I don't know the blueprints for any of these. So I have to have physically, and you can see like this SVD, for example, we have one of these available. Now you're like, oh man, what box did I put it in? There's a trick that I just found out last night. You go up here to the top, gun parts storage. Go to gun parts storage, find your sniper rifle right here, the SVD. I can put it straight into my backpack. It's now in my backpack. I don't know where it was. It was probably right here, but now it's in my backpack. So that's really cool if you have, you know, 17 dump bins and you don't, haven't organized anything yet. You can just come right up here, grab the item that you need, because until you learn the blueprint, you physically have to have the item in your bag, in your inventory, in order to do the craft. So if I wanted a barrel, I'd have to put the barrel in my bag. You have to click off of it. That's a little weird, but now the barrel shows up as five. So... Just understand that's going to be something you're going to have to deal with. Now, I'm going to zoom over to the vendor. I'm going to show you real quick. You're going to need coin. Coin is is bought by selling all of this kind of stuff. You know, sell all your duplicates, sell all your furniture, your clothes, and you sell it to the merchant just like we always have. That hasn't changed. But there's new over there that I'm going to show you. All right, so now we are over here at the trader. The platform is a little bit bigger, and you'll understand why in a moment. So you can come over here, and you can buy your coins with stuff that you sell. You can also get a variety of things from her, as you always have been able to. But if you come back to this back section, well, there's a new guy. This guy sells blueprints. Now, if you got a check mark, you've already learned it. If you don't have a check mark, that's obvious. And then you can give your coin amount 
So like this infrared site, if I want to be forever able to build it, I can buy it for four coins. You just right click till it gets to four. Boom, you now have it. It's in my backpack and now I have learned it. Then if you want to go and get, I'll show you while I'm here, even though it's not part of weapons. You have a trader here for furniture items. They also sell things like safes, blueprints to do the safe. And then the last one is a vendor to do, well, I don't call it a vendor, it's a quest giver. So I want to take the contract and you pick a thing and you got to make that thing and then you come back and you get rewards for it. So that is how you are going to work on the new weapons bench. If you hit B, it is in this right here and it is... Advanced Firearms Workshop. So you'll just have to tier up a little bit. I think that's tier three. And you can make this. And then you can uh, craft all the happy things you want. Thanks for watching.